I have kind of been away off of social media the past couple of days due to the fact that lockdown has just like really lifted and I've been out there having so much fun, which I hope you guys have been having fun too, especially because it was Halloween. But now we are approaching the Christmas season. Nobody wanted to tell me about this. I've been away a little bit from social media and you know, I check Twitter and I, I see this. So there has been a lot of backlash against this influencer from Florida who posted in front of her dad's casket, you know, dead. Her, her father is dead and she's just doing Instagram model-esque photos in front of the casket, which by the way, her social medias are now taken down. I mean, uh, I wonder why. In an interview with NBC News, she actually defended her post by saying that different people handle grief in different ways. Everyone handles the loss of a loved one in their own ways. Some are more traditional, while others might come across as taboo. For me, I treated the celebration as if my father was right next to me, posing for the camera as he'd done on many occasions in the past, she said. And 20-year-old Jane Rivera still stands by what she has done and she believes that this is her way to grieve over her father. Okay, a couple of things. I personally don't want to take away the fact that everybody grieves differently. I mean, it's obviously very different to be, you know, posing and shit in front of your dead dad's coffin. I mean, as time goes on, shit just gets weirder and weirder and sometimes I feel like I'm living in a different universe because I can think maybe pre-pandemic or even up until a couple of years ago, this would not be happening. You know what I mean? If this happened a couple of years ago, people would be way more upset than they are now. And for obvious reasons, I mean, yes, while everybody grieves differently and I am nobody to tell somebody else how to grieve, I obviously just think, you know, I've got a dead parent in their coffin the last thing I'm going to do is do a little fucking Instagram photo shoot for it. Of course, that's just my opinion. May get me a little bit of hate. Like, don't tell her what to do and shit like that. Which I'm not, by the way. I'm just giving my opinions on the situation. I just think it's really fucking weird. You know, social media is getting weirder by the day and as more things like this happen, the more things like this really get normalized. Like, okay, go to a funeral and take a little Instagram photo shoot, do a little TikTok in front of it. Cause here's the thing, it's one thing to be posting about the funeral and whatnot, but to be making it out like a little photo shoot thing, I think is what really like irks me and other people especially. OMG, my dad died. Check out this new fucking drip though. Oh yeah, my dad died, but don't I just look hot as fuck. Nah, man. I, I don't know. I don't know. Social media is fucking weird. Influencers are weird. I don't care. At the end of the day, obviously do what you want to do with your life. But when you post it online, expect people to have opinions on it. Just like I expect motherfuckers on this video to have opinions about this as well. The last thing I'm doing at a funeral is doing an Instagram photo shoot. Like I said, very weird. Of course, my condolences go out. But to be off of social media for a couple of days for the very first time in a very long time, to come back to seeing this is just like, like the last fucking video was a bit too much for me. And now this, <laughs> it's getting weird. Anyways, leave your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. I love you all so much. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all soon. Me when someone dies.